Hello YouTube people! Usually I don't care about smartwatches, but this one is not like the others, because this one measures blood pressure. YHE Tech company has sent me this watch for free, I don't have to ship it back. So thank you very much for sponsoring this YouTube channel. Now let's take a better look at the watch. Watch arrives in this box where you will find user guide, instructional manual, the watch itself and USB charger. Comfort is very good, it is very stable on the wrist and the strap feels very nice. It is something like in between silicone and rubber because it is not as sticky as silicone, yet it is not as stiff as rubber. It does feel very comfortable on the wrist. Brightness of the screen is very good. Let's set it to max and I want to compare it to my phone. Also set it to the max. And from this example, as you can see, it looks like watch has even brighter screen than my phone, which is very nice. Like other smart watches, this one also has different themes to choose from on the app. And let me show you two of my favorite ones. I like this one because it is simple, clean, looks very classy, very elegant, even though it doesn't show much of an information. And let me show you another one, which is also clean but does show a little bit of information like battery life and day and date. This watch is very easy and simple to use because it has similar menus to the phone. Just swipe it down to adjust the brightness and some other functions. Swipe it up to see messages if you have connected it to your phone. Swipe to the right to see how many steps you have made. Swipe to the left to see latest blood pressure testing, heart rate. Uh, SPO2 max. If you want to access the main menu, just press this big button. And here is the main menu where you can see all the functionality. Also has some workout functions, alarm, uh, weather function. It shows the current weather in your location. It also tracks HRV while you sleep. Uh, and in the settings, you can change the language, of course, units and important thing you can set the display to be always on or raise on you know when you flip the wrist it raise uh, it turns on and basically that's it it's very simple and if you want to turn off the display just press this little button that's it very simple thing to use app on the phone is also very easy to use very easy to understand you can track all kinds of statistics as usual also interesting thing you can see uh, how your family members are doing if any of them are wearing the same kind of device also it's very easy to change the theme on your watch from the app uh, change the units all kinds of settings it's simple well laid out very easy to use now before i measure my blood pressure let me show you how it works just hold this big big button and it starts inflating this pillow on on the strap it looks crazy i mean it looks crazy just look at it also this pillow is very soft it feels very nice on the wrist it's so crazy that this watch has mini air compressor inside that inflates this pillow and look it's pretty stiff i mean it, it inflates pretty well so yeah it's crazy looking device so you know what let's deflate the pillow and let's measure my blood pressure using it is a very simple just make sure it is tight so tighten it up a little bit make sure it is not sitting on your wrist bone it has to be above your wrist bone so hold the big button for a few seconds and it starts inflating the pillow now just 
take a deep breath, relax, sit and don't speak, don't move. You have to be stationary and stable for like one minute or so. Usually it takes less than one minute. Uh, you have to hold your hand like this to keep uh, watch at the level of your heart to get more accurate measurements and uh, it's almost done almost done just a little bit more patient and it's real time it's not speeded up it doesn't take that long also surprisingly one measurement like this takes about one and a half percent of the battery just one and a half percent according to my experience which is surprisingly efficient so here are my results as an end note i would like to say that in my opinion companies like this yg tech company who create and build devices like this do deserve our respect because a device like this has a big potential of preventing bad things happening to your health early on before you even feel that something is off that's very important because stupid thing about health is once you actually start feeling physically that something is not right with your health, it is already a little bit too late and it's going to take you an extra effort to fix your health, to get your health back in check. But uh, just imagine a situation, somebody who is feeling just fine yet, feeling just fine yet from geeky intentions buys something like this and measures measures himself and finds out that numbers are not right something is off maybe the device is not measuring your heart correctly but who knows maybe your heart is not working right you aren't gonna mess around with your health you are gonna see the doctor and here comes the big potential of preventing bad diseases early on before you even start feeling that something is off and that's why something like this deserves our respect and companies like YG tech company deserves our respect for creating something like this so thank you for sponsoring my youtube channel once again see you next time goodbye